Hello everyone, welcome back to 2020 TO4JCS podcast call. My name is David Yeo and I will be your host today. This is our second episode. Today is second day of September, which means we are very close to choose a holiday. So today, we want to talk about Korean culture. Through this episode, we want to know more about how other people are spending their holiday. Today, we prepared four questions, which are, what is my most favorite Korean food? The second one is, what is my most favorite Korean holiday? The third one is, what do I do during Chuseok? And the last one is, what is my favorite things on Chuseok? Among these questions, I chose two questions, and I two questions, which are second one and third one. So my first question is, what is my favorite Korean holiday? To this question, I think my favorite holiday is Children's Day. The reason why I like Children's Day is because I always get gifts and I can meet my grandpa who is living in a very far place. So I cannot meet him a lot. And in Children's Day, I can meet my grandpa. So I think it's very happy. And in Children's Day, uh, one person called Bang Jung-hwan 선생님 made that. And the reason why he made Children's Day is because he thought children and others, uh, others are not thinking children as really uh, needed. So he thought it is very unfair to children. So he made Children's Day. So it is Korean's traditional holiday. So I like Children's Day. And also I get lots of gifts. So I like Children's Day. My second question is, what do I do during Chuseok? I feel like I'm learning lesson every Chuseok. And that is, I feel like family loves me because I'm the youngest in my family and they care about me. So I feel very happy about that. And these days, uh, because there were COVID-19 and we couldn't meet uh, our family, but I think this Chuseok, we can meet our family and we can have great time. So usually when we meet, uh, we do a paddock and we sometimes do, we always do bowling and every morning we go out to mountain and hike and also get some chestnuts, and it is very fun. It is also very delicious to eat lots of uh, foods that our, un- our aunts made, and I think it is very fun. Now, I would like to invite Emma to share her opinion about Korean culture. Hello, everybody. Um, I select my first question, which is, what is my favorite Korean holiday? Which is, 설날, January 1st, which is the starting point of the new year, which is my favorite holiday. The reason is, of course, that all Korean children may agree, because we are getting monies from adults. I I really appreciate to adults, especially for my family has lots of kids. I really appreciate to adults, especially for the family, has lots of kids. And Sarna comes almost right after Christmas, so the money will just like evaporate. However, being an unofficial representative of Korean children, Sarna money actually makes children's heart to pounding a lot than the adult imagine. Okay, then I'll start a talk about Korean traditional events on Sarna, I rather keep talks about my personal unofficial opinion that represent Korean kids, which is tteokguk, the rice cake soup. I know it sounds awkward to say literally rice cake soup in English, but there is special meaning for the tteokguk. That's when, when we finish eating rice cake soup, then we get one year older. I have no idea whether only our family does or not, we actually eat lots of tteokgu given four to five times to beat up our siblings by age. We believe that eating lots of tteokgu, which is rice cake soup, meaning getting on age. So we just like eat a rice cake soup the same as other siblings age and call like ya. Yeah. And then family scold us. The second question is, what is my favorite thing on Chuseok? 
My favorite thing on Chuseok is uh, buying the Chuseok gift set with my family. Thinking about others that I love and buying the stuff that are helpful to loved one are my favorite things on Chuseok. This is also my favorite stuff during preparation or for the Chuseok. But while we were buying the gift set, we could also buy the things that we need. For example, the clothes, note, and stuff. Also, while buying the stuff, we could talk with my family and spend time with them. Now, I would like to invite Rina to share her opinion about Korean culture. I want to introduce my favorite Korean food. Um, my favorite Korean food is songpyeon. So songpyeon is very common in Chuseok and in Korea. Um, I like it because they put various ingredients like red beans, sesame seeds, and pine nuts. And second, I like to make songpyeon with my family. Um, we usually gather together to make songpyeon and celebrate Chuseok. And I want to explain a little about songpyeon. So, songpyeon is a Korean food made of glutinal rice traditionally eaten during the Korean Autumn Harvest Festival Chuseok. You can make songpyeon by kneading rice powder with hot water and stuffing the dough with bean, sesame, chestnuts, and other fillings. Once you have the half moon shaped rice cakes, stream them on top of a bed of pine needles. Pine needles will stop songpyeons from sticking together and add fresh fragrance. And also, I was always curious why they put pine needles, uh, but I heard that it's because they believe that the spirit of the pine tree emitted from the pine needles makes you healthy. Second, I want to introduce my most favorite Korean holiday. Um, my favorite holiday is, yes, Chuseok. Huh. It's because we're very close to Chuseok holiday. And second, I l really love to eat fall fruits a lot. Like, for example, pear, apple, or persimmon. Yes. And third, uh, I couldn't even imagine exercising these days. But in Chuseok, I can maybe um, ride a bike or go to Hangang and exercise. Yes. We think it was a good time to learn more about each other's opinion on spending their holiday. In this Chuseok, we hope everyone can spend their Chuseok happily. Then see you in the next episode. Bye. Bye. Bye.